Thank you for your service, Sheriff. Yes. Yes. Next up, following the sheriff is Don Sayward family and his Morgan horses. Don Sayward is pleased to lead your parade today with his horses Tony and Cisco. Accompanying him are his family, Levi and Courtney, and his grandsons, Colden and Landon. Please, they ask you to remember to thank my North, to thank your veterans who served this great nation of ours so we can enjoy freedoms such as these today. Do you think when horses get married, they go to the bridal suite? <laughs> I don't know. Let me introduce you to Jim and Sue Allen. They are humble, steady, hardworking, the stuff that makes a vibrant community. For almost 60 years, this quiet, understated duo have together made a remarkable contribution to the entire area. A little more than 60 years ago, Jim, a young third generation farmer from Peru, became engaged to Sue Strait from Jay. Just before they were to marry, their designated home on the river road suffered a severe fire. Still, the marriage in Los Angeles Forks went forward as planned, and the young couple moved into the half-burnt home, climbing a ladder each night to reach the bedroom. You see, the stairwell was burnt as well, so they had to use the ladder. It was there that they raised four children and blessed the area with a farmer's presence and hard work. They lived in the restored family homestead until they retired the Signa Road. You can see them in church every Sunday and you will often notice them in the background working for the cheer the church throughout the year. But more often than not, they epitomized what it means to be a good neighbor. Ask the neighbors. They are always checking in on everyone. The word is clear for all that know them as a neighbor. Their door is always open. They give food when needed, not even having to ask. They provide wood to help carry your neighbor through the winter. And if you did yeah. not know the neighbor, you would never know that this was from them. They are the backbone of what makes a community. And that is why our community is proud to have them this year as our grand.